just a weird angle and location to be starting a reading vlog. But hey guys, welcome to this week's reading vlog and I'm reading Fangirl this week. So, like I was saying, I'm reading Fangirl. Let's turn off the air conditioning so you guys can hear me. And I've already started it. So I started the audiobook yesterday. I'm buddy reading this with Macy from The Bright Side Girl. And we were supposed to be taking like so many pages a day in reading them. But like myself, I got caught up in the audiobook and I'm, whoa, someone's sad. Um, what's wrong? Oh, really? Let's go see what's going on. Winter finished her bone and now she wants Dakota's. And Dakota's like, hell no, girl, you ain't getting my bone. Hey, baby. Guys, like I said, I got caught up in the audiobook yesterday. Me and my boyfriend were listening to it while we were like rearranging my room. Sorry about that, guys. She gets mad. She gets really mad. Win win. I'm gonna give her one of these dry things that I made. Hopefully, she'll be good. Yep, I figured so. So anyways guys, welcome to like my new like living room setup if you guys haven't seen any of my vlogs recently. So my fish tank used to be on this wall and had actually taken out most of my sectional and put it into my storage room. But I really am liking everything. This is my desk because I work from home. I need a desk guys. Long story on my desk. But anyways, I'm really liking Fangirl. I'm like on page 273 I think. So yeah, 273. And the audiobook is amazing. I love the dynamic. Rainbow Rowell's writing is really fun and interesting. And her characters are really well written and driven. And I can't wait to carry on and read Carry On here in the next few weeks. It won't be in this video, but I will have a video coming out on that. When I read it with Macy, because we're reading Fangirl, Carry On, Wayward Son, and Hunting Prince Dracula this month. So that's going to be a lot of fun and interesting. But yeah, guys, this is what we're doing. Welcome to my first reading vlog of August. This is a weird angle, but I have spent most of the afternoon pre-filming a lot of videos that I want to get out for you guys, and I'm really excited about some of the videos that are coming out soon. I made dinner, and now I think I'm going to listen to a little bit of Fangirl. I don't really have that much left in it, and it's been really good. I'm so excited. Okay, guys, we just finished Fangirl by Rainbow Rowell, the audiobook. Oh my gosh, this was so cute. I loved this book so much and the audiobook is really good and I don't know this was just really really good I'm kind of torn on my star rating right now because I'm like 4.5 5 star I don't know I loved it so much the only reason I probably wouldn't give it a full 5 stars is because it kind of felt I don't know some things didn't wrap up as nicely as I wanted but it's so good I'm finally glad that I jumped on this Ben Ragan. So good. I love Rainbow Rowell's writing and her character dynamic and her character plot. Oh, I just love this book so much that I really want to jump in to carry on like right now. I know Macy just finished this book also tonight, so I might see if she wants to go ahead and jump in to carry on. We'll just have to see. But anyways, guys, we're going to bed and I will talk to you guys tomorrow. <laughs> As you guys know, I finished Fangirl last night. I loved Fangirl so much. But anyways, this morning I took the dogs for a walk and I made me some coffee after I've gotten back and took a shower and just letting my hair dry. I don't like using tons of heat on it all the time. But what I'm doing this morning is I edited a couple videos. Well, I had to work and then I edited a couple videos. But I only have like 30 minutes of work today, which was really weird. I have tomorrow 
completely off and I'm going with my friend and to check out some cars that she is interested in buying. She's asked me to go along with her and I'm so excited to go along with her and look at some cars because I might be in the market myself getting a new vehicle here soon. So why not look while she's lo looking also. My mom's going to keep the dogs. But anyways, the dogs are extremely, extremely exhausted and they're both in their crates asleep. I'm drinking my coffee and editing videos. But, anyways, I'll tell you guys that I'm listening to the audiobook of The Deal. I think this is by Ellie K Kennedy. And this is pretty much about a girl who you find out that gets raped when she's like 15, 14, 15. And she has a problem with guys, but she's not like hating on guys or anything. She's just still kind of having some reservations about getting to know guys. But anyway, she's very smart in this class, and there's this hockey player who needs some help being tutored, and th so they kind of work out a deal that they will fake date, and she will tutor him because she is really wanting this football player, and he thinks that it's a fake date, then it will boost her popularity, and she will eventually get the football player because, you know, that's how guys work. But, you know... I'm really enjoying it right now. I think I'm like 40, 45 percent through with it, and I started it back on Sunday, so I don't know. I'm really, really enjoying it so far, but I know we're getting some juicy stuff now. We're at the point where I'm at, and yeah, it's getting good. So I will talk to you guys soon. I might work on my diamond painting here in a little bit once I get some videos uploaded and listen to more of it, but right now I need to videos uploaded. I do need to check a couple emails for work and then I'll be done for the day for that part and then I can just listen to audiobooks and just do what I want around the house. I could find a way to break through, a way to break through. morning but I'm getting ready to go drop my dogs off with my mom because she's gonna watch them today then I'm gonna go meet my friend Lorianne and we're gonna go look for her some cars today so I might take a book with me just in case um, I have time to read if there's like a lull and we have to sit and wait for a long time because everybody knows how I'll buy in a car is. but yeah good morning um yesterday I finished the deal oh my gosh I love that book so four stars it was so cute and romantic and I don't know, I love Garrett with a passion and I actually want to pick up the second book, but it follows a different teammate from that series, I think. And I started Carry On, but I only got like three chapters in, so I haven't gotten far. And I'm listening to the audiobook of that also. So today I want to pick up a physical book to take me. So let's get ready. <laughs> all day helping my friend get a car she got a new car how exciting but I've not read anything today I took a book to read today but it's so busy I didn't get time to read so I'm showered it's like 7 30 I'm exhausted I got a little bit of stuff to do maybe call Macy and talk to her for a little bit and I'm going to bed both of the girls are out let me show you <laughs> but yeah we're going to bed I'm tired see you guys tomorrow <laughs> tell that I'm exhausted so after I got off the phone with Macy last night I ended up having to work till about 2 a.m. this morning because we have some emergency stuff going on and I took all day yesterday off to help my friend sorry I'm moving the camera around to help my friend find a car and so yeah I had to do some extra work last night thankfully today I don't really have that much to do this morning so at some point in time, I do want to start Carry On today. I really want to try to get that book done. I don't think I can finish it today, but at least maybe by tomorrow I can get it done. But yeah, that's kind of my check-in. I'm going to let you guys go because I need to make me some coffee and get some work done. And I will talk to you guys soon. <laughs> with work.
shirt for the day, but I ended up having to work a lot longer than I thought, which is fine, but I listened to a little bit of Carry On Today by Rainbow Rowell, and I only got to page like 106, and I'm just kind of bored with it, but I think the reason why I'm bored with it is because I'm tired, I'm exhausted, and all I want to do is go lay in bed and take like a little cap nap. <laughs> Hey guys, so I ended up taking like a two hour nap today. I don't know if I checked in with you guys since then. I don't think I have. I got up and made some keto fat bombs that I've been trying out and have had a couple of times. But I think I'm going to pick up Ludley for a little bit. I'm feeling a lot better. Like I was just exhausted from not getting a lot of sleep from last night. Yeah, last night. So I'm going to pick up Ludley, see how I feel about it. If I can get through a couple chapters, then that's fine. If not, then I might be going to bed early because I'm still feeling a little bit tired. So I don't want to push myself because I won't remember anything in the book if I push myself too much. Good morning, guys. Wow, this is weird lighting. But I ended up reading five chapters of Blood Leaves last night before I passed out. I only got to like 30 minutes if that into it. I was reading so slowly and decided that... I needed to go to bed so now I'm cooking a little bit of breakfast for me and the dogs and I don't know I have a lot of work to do this morning and then this afternoon I really don't have that much to do we'll see how the day takes us I'm not feeling carry on at all so I don't even know if I'm gonna pick up the audiobook of that today we're just gonna have to see <laughs> from hiking the girls have frozen kongs to hang out with for a little bit i haven't really done any reading i'm about to actually probably lay in bed and eat some lunch and probably pick up blood leaf so let's see how much of that i can get done today i'm so tired and yesterday was a really bad day and i didn't do any reading so we're just gonna skip yesterday but Anyways, guys, let me eat some lunch, and I'll probably pick up Blood Leaf here in a little bit. Okay, guys, somehow I did a little bit better and carry on. Uh, we've been listening to the audiobook, but we just got to page, I don't even know, right at page, or, so right at the start of book three, I don't even know what page this is. Hang on one second. 222, 221, and carry on, and honestly, guys, um... At first, I was really bored and wasn't enjoying this, if you guys saw at the beginning of this vlog, but now I'm enjoying it a little bit better. I'm still not full on, game on. I'm like, oh my god, I love this so much. I feel like I'm missing a lot of the story, and I thought, because I love Fangirl so much and I knew that we would be missing a lot of the story, that I'd be okay with that, but I just, I don't know, like, I really wish I had, like, the other books that they're talking about in this book before this book i don't know i just i know we're getting a, a lot of good backstory and everything like that but i don't know i just wish i had more i guess you can say so anyways i think we're about to go get in bed and lay down i might pick up ludley for a little bit we'll have to see i read like 30 pages earlier before i passed out and, went and took a very very long night but yeah anyways that's kind of my reading update, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for my last day of this vlog. Okay, guys, let's talk a little bit. This is going to be end of this vlog. Sorry that I haven't really vlogged a lot the last few days. I've had a weird, crazy week. I've had a lot of people pass away friends and family and work has been crazy as you guys know I work for the cruise line and we're postponed again so let's just say that I finished the audiobook of Carry On by Rainbow Rowell and I've decided that I'm not going to be carrying on with Wayward Son because honestly even though I loved Fangirl at the beginning of this video so much like I loved Fangirl so much guys I don't know if I can tell you guys how much I actually love that book but this 
lacked a lot of luster, if you can say. This needed a lot more polishing. I felt like I was in the middle of a story that had been going on for years on end, and we came in in the middle of it, which I understand that's the whole point of this book, that all this has happened up to this point. I did like the romance and the cute factor of Simon and Baz. I did like that a lot, but uh, Penny is one of my favorite characters, I think now. But overall, I just didn't enjoy this book. Like, I don't even know how to rate this right now because I didn't enjoy it. And I hate that because, like I said, I love fangirl so much. I'm cooking some stuff on, on the stove, so I might have to go over there and stir it up a little bit. But anyways, guys, this is going to be end of this vlog. I'm disappointed in myself and this book. I'm not going to say in myself because, you know what, I can't like every single book that I pick up. But I just really wanted to like this so much, and I just didn't. So anyways, guys, I hope you like this video. Please remember to like and subscribe to my channel, and I look forward to seeing everybody soon in my next video.